there, but do I see? There's one. Come on up here, Griff. Can I just tell you how much we have missed you? We have missed you so much. I, you know. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad you're here today. I've got something for you today. I want to show you something. Oh. Oh, I didn't see. You. Look at that tiny. I didn't see that little head back there. Do you? Would you like to come up here, sunshine? That's okay. We're gonna sit right here on the bench. Oh, thanks, choir, for letting me know. Sorry, Rick, I didn't mean to run you over here. You want to sit up here with me on the bench? And look, we have another friend today. I didn't even see. Oh, come on down here. Hi. Come here, sunshine. What's your name? I know it's hard sometimes when it's you. Elijah, hi Elijah, this is Griffin, and I'm Pastor Cindy, it's nice to meet you. Do you want to sit with Mom? Okay, you guys can sit over there, all right? I brought something to show you today, though, Elijah and Griffin. Do you know what this is? A wallet. A wallet, that's right, it's a wallet. And what do we usually have in a wallet, Griffin? Money, yeah, sometimes. Pastor Cindy doesn't have a whole lot of paper. She has a lot of paper, but paper looks like this. You know what this is? That's a, that's a receipt, Is that's not money, right? And then the other thing I use a lot, and, and Pastor and Larry will tell you, is this. Do you know what this is? Ah, he doesn't know. That's a good thing. <laughs> Can anybody tell Griffin and Elijah what this is? A credit card. That's right. A credit card is something that grown-ups use when they don't have. Let's see if I have it. I hope I will. Shoo, I do. When they don't have this. Do you know what this is? Money. Money. Yeah. So we've got money today, and we've got credit card today. And the reason that Pastor, Pastor Cindy hardly ever has any money with her, she usually uses this kind of money, plastic money. And what this is, says is that if I don't have the money, I promise that I will pay you the money in the future. So that's what that is. We'll put that away for right now. Because I want you to look at this, at this money here. And can you see in this round circle, what is that? What does that look like? A person. A person, that's right. There's a person on my money. Can you tell me who that person is? I don't really know who he is. You don't know who he is? Oh, you can tell him as a boy, though, right? Yeah, okay. How about anybody out there? Can you help Griffin tell him who? Just yell it out if you know whose picture is on this, this dollar. George Washington. That's right. Who's George Washington? The first president. See here on our dollar bill, it says the United States of America. Yeah, so they, came, they printed this and they decided it would be good to put the president's faces on these. And back when Jesus was around, they didn't have presidents then. They had an emperor. They had somebody who ruled over all the people. And his picture was on the money. And that's probably why we use our picture. Now, they talked in our story today about paying taxes. Do you know what taxes are? Everything that we have is God's, but guess what else? What else? 
else does it say on your cheat sheet there, people? And all of our is also ours. Oh, so not only everything that we have belongs to God, but everything that God has, God gives to us. That's, that's pretty awesome, isn't it? Yeah. So what are we supposed to do with this dollar, Griff, when we're in church? What do we usually do with our dollars? Yeah, we pay stuff, but in church, who do we give our dollars to? To people, or to do whose work? God's and Jesus' work, that's right. <coughs> and so today is the third Sunday in October. And what does that mean? I've got those little buckets there. Do you remember what that means? What do we collect on the third Sunday in October, or in the month? Money. Money, yeah, we collect our joyful noise offering, so that we have money to help out with our music ministry, and help out with different kinds of ministries that we do here at Christ Church. So would you get a bucket? Maybe you can give one to Elijah, and he can maybe help us if he wants. Elijah, what we're going to do now is we take some buckets around, and we're going to collect some money from some people our, so we can use your help, and Lauren will help us. And how about if we put this dollar in there? Would that be good? All right, great. Thanks.